My brother's giving me a ride today. Uh, I'm just waiting for him to get ready. We work at the same place, so he's been giving me a ride lately. There's this thing I've been wanting to talk about, which is Bitcoin ideas. So we're still waiting for widespread Bitcoin adoption. A lot of people I've talked to at work about Bitcoin don't get it. They don't understand the practicality behind it. I think there's so many use cases for it that people don't realize yet. So here are some examples that I've thought of over the past few weeks. Paying for Bitcoin at a restaurant. Usually at sit-down restaurants you get your check. I don't know why they call it a check. It's a receipt or a bill. It sounds nicer, I guess. Um, you get your check and it has your total that you need to pay. In addition to the other, what, what else is on the receipt, there's also a Bitcoin QR code. You could optionally pay with Bitcoin using your smartphone. No wallet necessary. Pull out your phone, scan the QR code, send your Bitcoin. The people at the front are notified that you've paid and you walk out. Another restaurant idea. drive throughs In the drive through imagine if there's a extra monitor between the ordering with the ordering station, the menu area, whatever that is, and the pickup window. And on that extra monitor, there's a number of Bitcoin QR codes. Um, one for each, because you know there's usually several people online. One of them is yours. You scan your Bitcoin QR code. The QR code disappears. You paid. You get your window. Get your food at the window. You drive off. It benefits the restaurant because they could increase their throughput because there's no handling of cash or swiping credit cards. It's done before the customer even gets to the window. There are probably better ways of doing this uh, other than a monitor because you could scan the wrong QR code. There could be like a beacon type thing where I'd have to put some more thought into that. But basically some wireless method to pay your Bitcoin instead of a QR code might be a little easier in that case. My chariot awaits. I couldn't think of a song to make, so I did this song instead. Police car burning testing. It just makes me want to throw and crush it. That's a lot of fortune cookies. During lunch, I bought a van. Little teaser. I'll show you the rest later. More Bitcoin use cases. Banks. No, not banks. <sighs> banks are obsolete with Bitcoin. Which is why Bitcoin will probably never take off. It will though. It's the future of money. Um, banks are probably going to take Bitcoin soon. No, I don't know. I'm going to start over. More use cases for Bitcoin. Payroll. Businesses that do direct deposit. Direct. Did I even say that right? I'm really hungry. Which makes me silly. Direct deposit. Zero fees for the employer. And instant. Depending on if the minor fee is paid. Near instant funds transfer for the employee. How to move. Who's that nerd? Ubuntu Snappy was released announced yesterday. I was learning about CoreOS, but I think I'll use this instead because I'd rather use DACA than Rocket. I like pentatonics. What's the word for this song? Good? It's so good. Microtransactions in video games. Say you want to buy your hats in TF2. You have to add funds to your Steam account. Go to the Manco store, buy your hats. What if next to each hat there's just a, a, a Bitcoin QR code? Scan the QR code, instantly you have the hat. It makes so much sense, especially for microtransactions. Before, like a dollar was the minimum you could, you would really want to accept on PayPal through PayPal because of the fees, and even then, it's there's a lot of fees. Bitcoin, nothing. You could pay five cents worth of Bitcoin. No fee, uh, minor fee. There is a minor fee, but it's optional. If you wanted it to be instant, you'd need to pay the minor fee. But um, say you've got a video game, like you bring up your mini map, you make it big, there's a QR code on the mini map. Scan that QR code on the mini map, and suddenly a bomb drops on that spot. Uh, 
No, I, that's probably a bad idea because pay-to-win games usually aren't fun. But if you scan that Bitcoin QR code, everyone's gun disappears and it's suddenly a disco party. That would be fun. Fun things, kind of like hats, where they're kind of pointless other than they look cool. This one's probably my favorite because I'm actually working on this. Bitcoin QR code overlaid on Twitch streams that when you scan it, something happens in the video, like a candy dispenser activates and the person who's doing the Twitch stream is like, oh, thank you, viewer, so-and-so. Actually, it would probably be anonymous unless you had a separate QR code on a website where you could also submit a message with your Bitcoin transaction. I'm kind of excited right now because I have a van out there and a pizza in there. Pizza!